Boker Tov, this is Yishai, that's Hebrew for Jesse, which is English for Yishai. Today is September 11th, 2020, 22nd of Elul, 5780, Kafbet Elul, Parshat, Yitzavim Vayelech. Here we are, um, September 11th. It's a hard day for a lot of people. Um, we definitely remember it wasn't so long ago, but it was so long ago. It was a long time ago, seems like, but it doesn't, it was like yesterday for a lot of us. Sitting here in Sfat in a military cemetery. Um, I figured it would be a good place to make a video and share my experiences with September 11th. Um, I joined, I was 18 years old, joined the Navy before September 11th. Um, actually went to boot camp September 16th, 2001. And um, so uh, I went to boot camp September 16th, 2001. And from there, I, was, I went to the USS John F. Kennedy. This is my hat. It's about 16 years old, this hat. <laughs> Still has paint from the ship on it. Um, and we were uh, actually from uh, they were supposed to be on deployment and just going around the Mediterranean hitting every port and just being in, it's called a med cruise but instead we pulled out and um, in 2002 and just went straight to the Indian Ocean to uh, join out Operation Enduring Freedom where I worked on the flight deck eight, almost 18 hours a day and uh, we hit a few ports like maybe two ports Bahrain and Dubai and stuff and <laughs> So uh, here we are, um, September 11th. The Parsha this week says uh, Hashem telling Moshe and the children of Israel, "I set, I, I give, I give you a blessing and a curse, life and death. Choose life so that you may live. You and your offspring may live. So we have, we always have blessings and we have curses, but we have the choice." On whether we choose life or death maybe that's what we do as Jews and as Americans and as Israelis we choose life so that we may live and sometimes people give up their lives so that we may live and we remember them today also remember everybody was needlessly killed due to hatred hatred and violence they chose the people who did it September 11th chose death but we choose life so that we and our children and our children's children will live. Uh, I remember on the JFK, the USS John F. Kennedy, one of the reasons I'm religious today, it was Pesach. And I went down, they, they made an announcement, all Jews report to the ship's chapel for Pesach services. I went down there and there's a guy in a full beard, a rabbi in the middle of the Indian Ocean. We had a Seder. From that moment on, I never ate chametz on Pesach again. And here we are today, I wanna serve in that capacity. I want to be a, be that guy who does that for people. That's my mission in this life, is to serve other people in that capacity. And so, I'm learning, I'm not giving up. I'm learning Torah, I'm learning to become a rabbi in smicha, and for smicha, and uh, yeah, it's all about service to God, our country, our people, and to the life, to life, l'chaim. So uh, here we are today, and I uh, just want to say I love you guys, and um, let's use these memories for good. Let's choose life so that we may live.